Hi there, my name is Ben and you're watching Mario Speedruns. This is show number six. I'm filming this on October 25th, 2015. Ah uh, yeah, so when we last left our character Morel, uh, he was at around 500 feet and level 14. I've been playing ahead of it and now he's level 15 and playing around 700 feet. We have that uh, amulet of the Magi that we got last time and I have good news to report. It does detect um, invisible creatures. So that's a huge hurdle that we jumped over, for sure. Um, other than that, um, we have a lot of food. Our wisdom and constitution is down. Level 700 or depth 700 is pretty challenging for us, but we can still stay down there uh, because we don't have to leave. We have some good escape technology. We have a ring of teleportation. We have a scroll of teleport. So if anything really gives us trouble, we can probably get away. All right, so uh, that's it. Let's have a look at Morel and let's see how we do. All right, let's play. Before we get started, let's check out the Wheel of Source Code. All right, let's spin it. What's it gonna be here, folks? Hmm. I do not know. Spinning fast, I see something about destroy, something about magic shop. Three, two, one, and stop. PRT comment six. Well, that one sounds pretty easy. It lives in store. Only four lines long. This one I can do. <laughs> this one I can do, oh my lord. Well, it might take a little bit more explaining because it is so short. <laughs> so, there's all these comments that the store owner can say. Um, some of them are in the comment six array. And there are a total of five of them there. We pick a random number between one and five, then we subtract one, leaving zero to four. And then we message print it, which puts it to the front, the, the top line. So here's comment six. I must have heard you wrong. What was that? I'm sorry. Say that again. What did you say? Sorry. What was that again? So that is print comment six, but where is it called? It's called in a few places. Two places, exactly. Uh, when we're haggling... And our new offer is uh, more than what he's asking. Then he's like, you've made a mistake. Then he says one of those things. And same thing when we are uh, selling. So when we're buying or when we're selling and we offer less than what he's asking, it's in his favor. So he says something like, I must have heard you wrong. Anyway, that is the print comment six function of a store dot store two dot c of the gmore sources and that concludes the wheel of source code hey 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 let's play some more you folks here we go wait for that timer to start wisdom and constitution still a little bit down hmm there we are 700 feet and we're in a special room here we're going to clear it together. As soon as that timer starts, all right. Okay, we're playing. Let's see. Cure light wounds. Don't need that. I guess it's probably a good idea to cast the detect monsters. Oh, my lord. Couple capital P's, a little P and an E. And a tick. That is what you call two... Uh, too tough for us, folks. We could die right here if we don't play this out right. Hmm. How do you want to do this? So anyway, uh, just a little laptop update. Um, no crashes since last time. Which is good. Those extra wires that are cut but don't do anything, those I think are for... Eesh. I 
I think those are for a touchscreen that I don't have the option for. So if you're wondering why the why the why why it could still pretty much work without those wires cut, maybe it's because of maybe it's because of that. Um, have we ever killed one of these guys? No. We'll leave him alone temporarily. Oh, he got us. We're out of there, folks. Hmm, no damage done. You know what? I have just the thing for this. We can learn a new spell because we are level 15. It's called Fire Bolt. Here he comes. Come on through the door. There he is. MCG. Bam. It is susceptible to fire. That's what you like to see right there. Do I push our luck and do it again? What is the um, fail rate on that spell? 44% fail, so we're not going to cast that again. We'll do a fire a frost bolt. Level 16. What was he worth? I guess we were just that close to, uh, to getting there. All right, that's one of the baddies. And that's how you waste your uh, mana right there. Try to call uh, Firebolt a couple times and fail. Hmm. Well. Let's do some running, shall we? He's right on our tail. So, I think maybe dump some lightning bolts into him. Or not. Maybe hit him with a stinking cloud wand. Look at our man, look at our hit points way down. We're going to die right here. Um, read scroll of teleport. Ah, we are still not out of the woods, folks. <sighs> We're going to die right here. <laughs> Cure critical wounds. Potion. 35. We're just going to cast a uh, phase door. Oh my lord. I don't like this the way this is shaping up, folks. But I don't want to call the word of recall. So what we're going to do is we're going to put on our ring of teleportation and it will get us out of this jam. Let's put it on in place of our feather falling on our left hand. Oops, it feels deathly cold. I know. Okay. Greedy little gnome. Oh, he could do damage with us for sure. Let's hit him with the stinking cloud. Hopefully he won't steal. Got him. Got him. Thank goodness for this wand of stinking cloud. That frog can ruin our strength. Uh, let's cast phase door to get away. Can't cast it. What to do? What to do? How do we get in this mess? <laughs> we tried to cast Firebolt. That's how we got in this mess. Let's look at that frog. Hmm. 
Hmm. I was hoping to see uh, susceptible to fire. We could throw a flask of oil at it. Confuse him? Is he able to be confused? Let's try. Okay, he's confused. This is good. Okay, a little bit of breathing room here. Oh, look at him go off there. I want to see a max wisdom chart. Yeah, sure. Not much to see there. I thought our wisdom was down a bit. Well, that's our maximum wisdom. Right. Right. Oh, we got another guy coming in. Man, this is bad for us. Aim. Stinking cloud. Aim. Stinking cloud. One more. Failed to use the wand properly. Look at our hit points, folks. 21. No charges left. 12 hit points. We can now... We could die right here. Um, we can now cast phase door, but then we'll have zero mana. Come on, phase door. Didn't really help us. Oh, boy. This could be it. Our character's so good. Do we really want to... Well, we have that Wand of Magic Missile. What is this guy? Large Gray Snake, so he can't blind us. He can probably poison us, which could be fatal at this point. Let's confuse him. Confused. Head for the door, folks. Head for the door. Oh, he's right on our tail. We're going into the unknown here. Who knows what we're going to run into. We're in another room. That's bad. We could try go on a trap and die. Oh. What is well, who's chasing us here? A greedy little gnome. Oh man. Can we confuse him too? Hope so. Appears confused. He touches us. We lost the ration of food. But he's confused. This is good. Um ten hit points left, folks. Now what? Move this way? Try to confuse this guy again? Unaffected. Uh oh. Zero hit points. Oh man. We are gonna die in this game. Oh. One hit point. What are we gonna do? Wand of Wonder, but we don't have any space. We just don't have any space to cast it with. If he was two tiles away, I would be using it. All right, up and to the right. We're in a corner. Oh, we're going to die. I don't know where he is either. But he's confused. No, he's not confused. Let's move down and to the left. There he is. Oh, we're gonna die. Up and to the right. What would you do, folks? Wand of Wonder him? Wand of Wonder. It's our best shot. Oh, I don't want to die in this game. Oh, here we go. Oh, I have a bad feeling about it. Is there anything else we can do? Anything at all? We can throw a fat flask of oil at him. We can do the Wand of Magic Missile. 
We have a strange gold-plated wand. Who knows what that does? Oy vey. One hit point left. He could poison us so so easily. He could hit us and kill us. <laughs> oh. Oy. Son of a crapper. We're gonna die. Oy. Another option that I haven't said is um, casting phase door, even though we don't have the mana, but we would still probably land in this room. You know what I wish? I wish our ring of teleportation would kick in right about now. If it kicked in, we'd be free. <sighs> free for a little bit anyway. All right. Ugh. I can't bring myself to do it. The Wand of uh, Wonder, because it can just be a random spell. It could make him faster. And then he would hit us doubly hard, you know, twice. Ah. <sighs> so it could be a bad thing, not just a good thing. Well, there's nothing left to think about. Let's hit him with the Wand of Wonder. Oh, we're going to die, folks. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Hit bonus chart. Yeah, but let's see something else before we kill off this character. Um, Hit points. Producing, producing. Yeah. That tells a story right there, folks. That's where we're at. <laughs> right down there. Oh, it sucks. Wand of Wonder it is. 22 charges. We're gonna die. Resigning myself to it, folks. Direction. You know the direction, Mr. Frog. Oh. We're dead. Bites you. Dead. <laughs> oh, minus eight. He hit us for a lot. Um, There's that Amulet of the Magi. A lot of good that did us. The one we didn't know about was Heal Monster. That would have been bad. There's no way to tell how many more turns until the uh, the Ring of Teleportation did its thing. Oh, that sucks. There you go, folks. So, um, we'll start a new game. Tried my best on that one. This time it's going to be a... Uh, a different thing. We're going to go with a halfling and a male, and it's going to be a rogue because we haven't done that. Um, let's just make sure our constitution is high. That's pretty good right there. That's going to leave our strength pretty low, though. And rogue. That's bad. <laughs> let's try that again. What happened there, I wonder? What's going on? Let's try that. Oh, that's bad constitution. Something went wrong with our code, which is scary. That's pretty good. It's going to be a mage again. Names. Noggle. So I guess we're not going to play the rogue. Something went wrong there. I'm going to have to look into that. Learn our magic missile spell. Wear our stuff. 
you know the story here, folks. Um, buy that lantern? Nah. Nothing to buy here. Let's go over to the uh, armory. And we're out of time. Shake fist. Can't believe we died, folks. Oh, it sucks. Oy vey. We should have called that... Uh, Wand of... Uh, scroll of Word of Recall. Anyway. I'll buy up... I'll, I'll make our character for the next one. Alright, let's take a look at the damn charts. Shake fist. <laughs> Hey, hey, let's look at the charts. Here's Morel. Okay. Our experience was really doing okay, except for that right there. If I were to do it again, and I'm gonna, I'm not gonna have any of those. None of those, because we're trying to beat this as quick as possible, right? Look at that nice steep curve at the end. Ugh. But it was a deadly curve. Because there's our hit points. Mm. Experience level, yeah. I guess we made it to level 16 in the end, yeah. After we got that tick. Armor class, bumped up and up. Gold pieces look good. Not much to say about our stats. 728 needed for the next uh, level. That's important because uh, we could magically get hit points if we leveled up. So, as far as getting away, we had that ring of teleportation. Um, we were sitting pretty good, really. Like, uh, if you look at our pack here. If we were blinded, we could have cured that. If we were confused, we could have cured that. You know? Like, we were doing pretty good. We had that scroll of teleport, which didn't help. Yes, sir. Okay, let's take a look at... Okay, let's see this. Four hours. That's how long we were uh, playing the game for. Eleven days in the dungeon. Okay, let's uh, see how we stack up. Well, Morel finally beat Magoo in number of days. Dungeon days played. All right. Morel couldn't quite beat Magoo there. Or anywhere else, probably. Um, yeah. Magoo is really a good character. Oh, we almost are on, we're almost there on kills, but we've fallen short. Highest hit point, 64 versus 89. AC, 20, not bad. 110 objects picked up. Money bags, we're not quite there. And the all-important score? Oh, we couldn't quite do it, folks. That is close. All right. So... Where do we go from here? Where do we go from here, I say? Um, oh man, we were sitting pretty with that, uh, with that Amulet of the Magi. Darn it, ugh. Oh. So, I don't know, I guess we'll just play our current character, Noggle, forward a little bit. Um, I'll take a look into why I couldn't start as a rogue, halfling, halfling rogue. What happened there? I don't know. So I would like to play that uh, race class combo. Um, what else can I say? That scroll of teleport really did the wrong thing. It dropped us in a room with creatures awake and right beside us. So that was bad. I don't, I guess uh, in hindsight, we shouldn't have been hitting that 
hill giant with uh, lightning bolts. Shouldn't have been doing it. Um, because our lightning bolts didn't hit him for anything like he was hitting for us. So we got down to six hit points so fast. And then it went downhill from there, as you know. So anyway, um, I guess uh, in the next game, we're going to focus on uh, not having any of those long drawn out periods of resting. So that means no, we're going to identify things the, the old way, the hard way, and we're going to, uh, what else? Um, try to not let anything get next to us, because as soon as they're next to us, they can uh, sap our strength or whatever, which causes us to have to rest because in the town they don't have a particular potion. So that's the plan. We're gonna try to beat Magoo, really. We're gonna do better than morale, I promise. Well, I can't promise. <laughs> but we're gonna go try to go at a speed that is reminiscent of Magoo. Okay. So goes morale, folks. Long live Noggle. <laughs> All right, I hope your game's going better than mine. Until next time, bye-bye.